So my friends, this episode is going to be a little bit of a special one uh, because I am going to take a short recording session and then I am going to uh, pause it because I need to talk to a friend of mine in about 20 minutes. After that I will continue to record hopefully <laughs> today and I will... Um, uh, let's check the map where we are going. We are going in the right direction, yes. And then I will edit it together in the computer afterwards and post it uh, tomorrow or so because the post editing when I do that is usually taking hours with the, with the render and stuff. So what I want to do in this episode is to complete the two quests that we were working on in the previous episode. We have the... Um, um, herbalist. We needed to find some, some plants for her. Let's see, actually, can we... Okay, let's just run, run through it. Um, and we also have the Scarlet Judge, which, which is our active quest right now. I actually want to change that. Let's see, we need to go direction here I believe yeah here it is the entrance let's change to uh, 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 this one I want to talk to her first finish up that quest and then we will finish up the quest hopefully with uh, let's see we need to go up here with uh, the Scarlet Judge and we should go in here I believe And she should be somewhere in here. Still straightforward, okay, that's good. Here she is, okay, nice. Let's talk to her and see what she has to say. There you are. Any luck finding the lichen? We'll need to be quick if we want full potency. Yes, I've got the lichen right here. Perfect. You may have noticed an odor. It's subtle, barely noticeable in fact, but once I add it to this wick wheat and quama shell solvent, ha ha! The perfect pheromone for the common house cat! Wait. Um, your revenge on uh, uh, Meltaron <laughs> Meltaronion is house cats? Surprised? He may have squeezed a few secrets out of me, but he revealed some facts about himself along the way. For instance, he's violently allergic to cats. Sprinkle this potion over the plants near his door, and the results should be... <laughs> dramatic. Well, that's interesting. Alright, here goes. So, we need to go in... Oh, he's actually um, <laughs> right here. Nice, that wasn't far to go. And let's take this one here. What's going on out here? Snooping, eh? Why, I have half a mind to... Cats? Ah! I'm trapped! Okay, let's talk to her. Hey, where are you going? No, that was just... Did you see the look on his face? A.M.'s mercy, he certainly wasn't exaggerating about that allergy. <laughs> what a buffoon! What now? Uh, do we just leave him in there? No, as much as I'd like to. You know the healer's oath. Do only moderate harm to those who cross you. <laughs> I brewed a tea that should alleviate his symptoms. You can give it to him. But only if he agrees to come out and make a public apology. What if he refuses? Then leave him to his sniffles and blubbering. Patients tend to avoid healers covered in their own snot. He can settle this business with his reputation intact. All he needs to do is apologize. Okay, so let's go in and talk to him. Is damnable cats! 
You don't look so good. Don't be coy. I know who's responsible for this travesty. I never should have told that scheming witch about my allergy. What a low-born, wretched, undignified prank. She brewed a curative tea, but demands that you apologize. Apologize? To a grubby telephony piss peddler? Are you deranged? I shall report her. I shall... Oh, oh what's the use? Fine. She wins. Ifrain bones. What a monstrous injustice. Oh, just give me that swill. Oh, it had better work. I'll let her know you've agreed. Come out when you're ready. Nice. <laughs> Let's go back out and talk to her. And she is over here. So, did Manodinian relent, or should we leave him to his wheezing? He agreed to come out and apologize. Oh, thank goodness. Luring cats to his door every day would have gotten awfully tiresome. In the end, he'll see it's for the best. Collaboration always yields better results than competition. You and I are proof of that, right? Thanks again, Sarah. Okay, so we received a stained alchemy smock, Sir Socks Ball of Yarn. Okay, <laughs> I guess that's a cat. Um, complete the quest. Nice. Okay, so we have this far in the episode for like seven minutes. Ah, oh, there he is. I wish to thank you for that most efficacious tea. And. Your alchemical skills yield impressive results. And? It was rude of me to malign your alchemical practice. I apologize. <laughs> Manoldinian, I forgive you. There's no reason for us to be at odds. We should try to cooperate, yes? Yes, <laughs> agreed. So, now that we're on good terms, can you please shoo these horrid creatures away from my clinic? Of course. I brew just the thing. Interesting drama is unfolding right here and now. Be seeing you, partner. Farewell. Okay, so I guess that's it. Let's go and talk to the constable. Ah! Where do we have her? Somewhere in here, it looks like. Where we spoke to her before, perhaps. Ah, here she is. Now there's a sight for so eyes. The Scarlet Judge returns. You wear it well. Better than Melar even. But don't tell him I said that. Melar refuses to leave the prison. He urges me to defeat uh, Laren as the judge. Shaw's bones, he's a stubborn one. Well, let's make sure he doesn't suffer in vain, hey? Eh? Laren's gotten sloppy since Melar's capture. A combination of paranoia and misguided relief, I guess. She's making mistakes. Now's the time to act. What's our next move? I did some snooping of my own while you were gone. According to Constable Krem, Hilaren ordered Inania's egg mine sealed today. Bet you a pint that Hilaren's meeting with her plantation allies in that mine. She's probably carrying your evidence, too. How do I get into the mine? The front gates are barred from the inside, but there's an old service door near the back. It just so happens Dradini had a spare key to sell. Sneak in the back of the mine and recover that evidence. I'll meet you out front, ready to arrest Hlaren. Alright, I'll retrieve the evidence and meet you at the uh, mine entrance. Nice! Okay, so I know that we have like a bunch of different quests that we can do here. But I am very curious to see where this actually leads us, so I will continue with this particular um, questline and see 
Uh, let's see, actually, where are we going? The mine is over here. It's right behind us, so if we go... If we try to go up here, we should be able to go around, I guess. Are we going in the right direction? Uh, 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 yeah, we seem to be. We should be able to get out here. And let's take this one. I don't know if how we can't take it. Okay, that's fine. Uh, we are going in this direction here-ish. Let's take care of you. Okay, 44 XP, that's nice. Let's sheath this for now. Let's see, we need to go. Mm -hmm. Actually, let's take care of you. A little bit of extra XP, never hurt. Oh, I missed it. <laughs> I was itching my, my chin when he attacked, so I couldn't uh, block the attack the way I wanted to, but that's fine. They don't do so much damage anyway, so... Uh, let's see, we need to go... Uh, 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 where are we going? Mm, okay, so if we go up here... I guess... Ah, then we go back here. Oh, come on! We just went in a circle. Okay, so, let me think. Uh -huh. We should be able to... But we can't go around. Because here we have the city. Let's go up here. Try again. Nice. And 44 XP. That's nice. Now, we went here. So let's try to go here. And walk around here. And I bet this is the world's longest detour in the history of detours. But we should, hopefully, be on the right track. Yeah, nice. Okay. So, let's attack you. And it's down. Nice. Let's attack. It's only 29 XP. It's Fairly worth it. Okay, let's just continue for now. So the entrance to the mine should be somewhere around here. Yeah, here it is. Okay, awesome. Do we have any anyone to kill? Doesn't look like it. Okay, let's enter. Inanuous egg mine. So I should need to end this part of the video in about five minutes or so. And then we see if I decide to upload these 20 ish minutes or if I um, just start a new session later on. We'll see. Oh, okay, that's fine. It's dead, nice, we have the next one here. I missed it, that's fine. And 
one more, and that's it. Nice, okay. So, she this for now. We need to retrieve stolen evidence. Uh, retrieve evidence of coalition, retrieve evidence of false arrest, retrieve slave testimony. Okay. So those are the three different kinds of evidence we need to collect. Okay, those are friendlies. This one is not. It. That's fine. So I want to kill a few of them and hopefully gain a level. Uh, not in this episode since we are about to finish up, but in the next episode hopefully we will be able to get somewhere. Let's do a uh, I missed it, that's fine. Okay, here we have the first batch of evidence. Oh, whoa! one. Uh, Karek, I understand your desire for prompt service, but you have to understand these things take time. I cannot just arrest every traveler that comes through Suran. Uh, even your new jail isn't big enough for that. I think we read this in, in the previous episode. The best prospects for um, conscription are those without family or support or those with a criminal record on whom I can hang new suspicion. Uh, if we arrest someone who can fight the judges or someone who has a powerful family behind them, our, arrest, uh, our arrangement will come to light uh, very quickly. I've just received word that a large caravan of refugees from uh, Syrjodil Sy uh, Syri uh, will be passing through tomorrow. I have uh, no doubt I'll find some reason to arrest a number of them. Your workers are coming. Be patient, H. Okay, so that's the first one. Nice. We have... Why is he still... Scrape jelly. Okay, we can't take it anyways. We're full. I have to try to remedy that before I continue the recording. Uh, so, let's see what more we can find. Actually, I'm looking at the time and time is up for now, I would say. Uh, I will take a break here. We will find the next se two sets of evidence in the second part of this video. Uh, but um, yeah, I will not say bye now, I will say bye in a bit. So my friends, it is now actually the next morning since I left off the previous recording session. Um, my The call with my friend turned out to be quite a bit longer affair than I expected it to be. Uh, anyways, I just logged in. Uh, I was loaded back into the game outside of the mines, so let's go in. The evidence that we picked up in the previous episode was saved, which is good. Um, I didn't spend that much time inside the cave in the previous episode, it was like 5 minutes or something. 
so it shouldn't take us that long time to get back to where we were. Um, I do have... Let's skip those. Um, I do have... We can take you, I guess. Actually... Oh, we can't skip those. They will actually follow us. Let's summon... Mark? No, it wasn't Mark anymore. Um, oh, I forgot the name that I have for, for my little friend here. Whoa. Okay, that <laughs> that was a good start of the episode. Okay, let's do it again. I can't do it. For some reason. Now, okay. Let's summon him. Ouch. And let's hit you. And let's take one of these. And take it. Oh, I missed. You missed. And that's it. Awesome. Oh yeah, I'm I'm still full. Crap. Let's give me one second and I will go to the inventory. I have so much supplies and stuff that I never use. This is actually quite... No, okay, this is gold I have. Does it say how much it's worth? I guess no. Destroy this. Will this remove 5 kilos? No, 1 kilo. Yeah, here we have a bunch of stuff. This one we can remove. It was only one kilo. No idea what this is. Apples. Okay, we have four kilos. That should be sufficient for now. I do have, I believe, about... 30 minutes left till I have to be at work uh, working from home today which is quite nice um, let's take care of you which also releases a bit of time for me uh, to do more important stuff than actually, than actually getting to work like this for example Crawlers, foul bait, okay. Let's see, we need to go in this direction here. It was in this passage here, if I remember correctly, that I left you in the previous episode. So this is now new ground that we tread. Let's take this. Actually, let's try this one. That attack reminds me uh, quite a bit about um, one of the attacks in Skyforge that you use quite a lot, or then that I use quite a lot. Um, they are quite similar. So we can go up here. I think the lightning only attacks one enemy at a time, unfortunately. it. Let's go and continue over here, I guess. Take care of you. Ah, here we have the next evidence. Nice. Let's take care of that one. 
Where'd you go? Over here? Nice. And he's down. Nice. Let's take the ledger. Esteemed Marshal, the last group of prisoners you sent me to work f uh, to work my fields have proven less resilient than I hoped. Okay, this we also read. That's bugging. Why do we need to find evidence that we already have? This, my friends, is pure laziness and actually quite some stuff that I expect from uh, Bethesda after the few years of their mis mishaps if we call it that. Okay, let's continue. They are without exception lazy, slow and dull-witted. Then again, no one ever said Bretons and Bosmer make good slaves. I miss the days when you could buy a dozen strong um, uh, Argun Argunians uh, for the price of a study wagon. As soon as possible, I'd like a few of those strong Nords you sent over to uh, Karek. As she and I have both agreed to your work for compensation plan, we both deserve an equal share of the resources. I refuse to settle for lower quality workers. Send me only your strongest and brightest. I have it on good authority that a group of Nords will be traveling through Suran on, uh, soon on a trading mission. If you manage to arrange one or two, arrest one or two, um, I'd be happy to take them off your hands. Until then, I remain your friend and confidant, Mistress Dren. Nice. Okay, so we are two down. Let's see, the next one is in this direction down here. Let's go up here. See if we can find anything to explore. It doesn't look like it. This is the end. Let's take care of you. Down, nice. This one is down in a second. Nice. Okay, uh, let's see. We don't really have anything to pick up over here. I like this maze, it, it makes a good quality weapon. Good damage on it. Uh, let's see, here they have it. Lightning form increased by to rank three. Oh yeah, I have the lightning form. I need to, <laughs> I need to do that one again. completely forgot about having that one. And I also noticed that even though I'm a sorcerer, I still tend to do me mainly melee, uh, melee damage anyways. But uh, that's, I guess, my cup of tea. I Even if this is not very exciting, it's like standing in one spot and just hitting stuff. Lightning form again. She's down. Nice. We have one over here, and this over here is my. The last batch of evidence. And let's take a 
heavy one, and she's down. Nice. Ooh, a level up. Uh, let's go here and see if I now can remember uh, where I needed to go for the leveling. I had the same issues last time. Um, and I still can't remember where I was. Uh, it wasn't that hard to find. Here, level. Uh, uh, claim rewards. Awesome. Yeah, I deserve that applause. I deserve that applause to be able to find it so quickly. So, uh, we have one attribute point. Let's put it on Magicka for now. This build is recommended for new players. Okay, and we have one skill point. I... We have nothing new on Dark. We have one new on Dedrick. Let's see what this is. You, um, you restore 726 Magicka when one of your Dedrick summoning pets kills or is or unsummoned. Oh, I like that. Uh, what? Oh, I wasn't supposed to do that. Uh, let's go back to skills. On Storm, we do have a new one. I think we should have a new one on Dark too. Increases your magical recovery by 5%. Okay, let's go up to Dark. Actually, no. Let's take, not that one, this one, and this one for now. Passive abilities. You purchased a passive ability. These are all, uh, always active, uh, granting you to um, granting you their benefits at all times. Passive abilities cannot be placed in the ability bar. Okay, nice. I will go up here and pick this one up. <coughs> Testimony of uh, BN Day, Dreton Laborer. Claims she was falsely arrested for murdering a beggar soon after arriving in Zuran. I think she was the one, the first one that we spoke in the field two or three episodes ago. Uh, insists that mur uh, she murdered no one. Also claims the guard of uh, Arano uh, plantation beat a red guard slave to death when he grew too weak to work. Testimony of uh, Gamush, orc trader. Claims he was falsely arrested for robbing and possibly murdering a dark elf farmer outside Suran. Claims he was arrested because he had no local connection or family who could uh, vouch for him, and also because he was an orc sold to Arano Plantation by Marshal Laren. This is also one that we spoke to, so I guess that the last one, number three down here, will be <laughs> also the third one that we spoke to uh, in, in that episode. Uh, again, repetition. Do they have no imagination whatsoever in this company? Testimony of um, Friga Berfist, Berf, yeah, Berfist Nord. Uh, Nord Drifter. Admitted to, and why do they, why don't they have the um, the heading on this page instead of the previous page? That's also really bad. Um, admitted to um, uh, assaulting uh, a master of uh, Arano plantation after he uh, inappropriately pro uh, propositioned her. Claims Marcel Laren told her that if she worked off the plantation, worked on the plantation, her jail sentence would be reduced. It was a lie. The master of Arno Plantation had no pl plans to ever free her. Yeah, I was right. That was the third person that we spoke to, and we have received a soul gem. Okay, so we need to find Marcel Laren. Which is over here, further into the caves. Ugh. 
does this form attack multiple creatures or only the one I'm targeting? I think it attacks both of them. And it's down. Nice. amount of XP so I'm very happy to do a little bit of grinding in here. It's down, nice. You should be down in a second. Nice. It's like 40, 44 to 46 XP per creature. I don't mind at all. Okay so now we're back to where we were before. Question is Is she like somewhere on another level? Or this is where we need to go. Ah, look at this. These delays are unacceptable with this. How could you be so close? My dresser will lost it. This bickering accomplishes nothing. The Scarlet Judge is in prison, yes? The issue is well in hand. You are mistaken. One of my informants saw the judge prowling the streets just this morning. Moloch's jawbone! You said you captured him! You said you broke his legs! What if he's not really a mer? What if he's a vampire? He's not a vampire! Stop sniveling! Enough! I've dealt with the judge. Your informants are wrong. Let's move on to more pressing issues, like how we move forward. And that seemed to be have been the end of the conversation. Okay. Uh, we don't really need to pick anything up at the moment. Can't be nice sleeping in here. Oh. Okay, let's go down and confront her and... Then we'll see what we do after that. Let's see, we can go over here, I believe. And up here. Okay, nice. Nice. What happened to him? That is what I want to know. Okay, so Marshall is up here. It might be that when we're in lightning form, those strong attacks that the creatures do doesn't actually really offend, um, affect us because I did try to block it but I think I failed but still it didn't confuse our character so I'm not entirely sure of if it if it does affect us or not what's this they found us Why? think you can smear my honor I'll have your head Ah, uh, my little creature over there is... Yeah, she sure, sure repaired. It's fine. Oh yeah, I could dodge in this game too. I completely forgot about that. I always... Ah, okay, let's summon a new, new one. Ouch. I'm stuck. I'm confused. Okay, now it's fine. The 
just get out of there perhaps. He has to be safe. Is dead. Nice. Okay, give evidence to uh, Constable Gre uh, Gretka, which means that we should go out. I guess this is the exit. Yep. Checking the time, it's 11 minutes left until I have to start working, so I hope that we will be able to talk to her um, before I have to finish off the episode. If not, then, I, then we will continue it in the, in the next one. Oh, she's right here. Nice, let's talk to her. We got these three trying to slip away. Should have seen their faces. It's a big risk arresting Saran's most powerful landowners. I'm hoping you've got the evidence to make it worthwhile. Where's Marshal Hlaren? Hlaren is not coming. Uh, here's the evidence that proves she, uh, she colluded uh, with the plantation owners. Resisted, eh? I had a feeling it might go that way. Hlaren was happy to send other people to prison, but going herself, uh, that rattled her knees. It's a shame she won't live to see the inside of a cell, but these three will, for at least a while. What happens now? With Hilaren dead, command falls to the senior officer. For now, that's, uh, well, that's me. I'll send constables out to the plantation to liberate the slaves. In the meantime, I've got to take this evidence to House Redoran. What about our mutual friend? Oh, Mela. Well, I took a hard look at the evidence. Far as I can tell, this was just one big misunderstanding. Friend and I released him just before we set out. You'll find him in town nursing his wounds, no doubt. You should speak with him. I'll do that. Okay, uh, so, talk to Melar Sadus, the former scholar judge, and that is... In which di in this direction over here. Okay, uh, back in town, which should be not far away if we go in this direction here. Oh, look at this! This is quite nice. Don't cause trouble. So, where do we have you, our friend? Let's see, he should be in this direction. He's below. So if we go down here, we should find him down here somewhere. Straight forward. Here he is. Let's talk to him, and then we will finish off the episode. Greetings, my friend. You cut quite the dashing figure in my old regalia. Another spectacular victory for the Scarlet Judge, eh? I will miss donning the cowl, but it does me good to know that my final adventure helped liberate the people of Suran. So you really plan to retire? Yes. But I do so knowing that the legacy of the Scarlet Judge is in good hands. We Dark Elves are beset on all sides by greed and scheming malice. I fought it all my life, but now it falls to you. Keep up the work, and be the hero Varenfell needs. Okay, let's complete the quest. Ah, and look there, the 
fruits of your labor. Okay, you receive the collectible. Your collectibles can be viewed and set active in your collectibles uh, menu. And that, my friends, was a really good way of finishing off this episode. It's good to see you alive, my friend. Oh, very good. Indeed. Forgive me for not getting up. Don't take this as an excuse. You're walking again, or else. And now they stop talking, so I will continue. Uh, I will finish off the episode here. I have recorded two 20-ish minute episodes that I will put together during today. And I will upload it this afternoon after work. But for now, my friends, I thank you so much for watching. Stay safe. And I'll see you next time.